Hello, this is Mary Jo with Fred's Used Websites, and I'm going to show you how to manage the photos in an animated image. So first of all, I'm going to navigate to one page that has an animated image widget already placed in it. As you can see, I'm already logged in. I have an option to log out, therefore I am certain I'm logged in. I also see the pencils here for the areas that I can edit. At this moment, I want to manage these photos. So first, I'm going to add a photo. And all I do <clears throat> is click on Add Photo. I have a pop-up window that allows me to choose a file. So I'm going to click on that Choose File and I'm going to navigate to where I believe the photos are going to be. And you can watch it uploading. There's the green line coming across and when it's fully loaded up it will show you that it's 100% complete. If I wanted to continue choosing files, I could do so. You can have them running. You can choose as many as you want. You just choose one at a time, and you can have five, six, seven, eight all running at the same time. When they're finished and they all show a completed green line, then you would close this window. And now you can manage the photos that you have up there. So perhaps I might want to move this photo that I just added to the beginning of the group so I would just drag it over there and now it's at the beginning of the group but actually I don't want it there I want it probably right here so see where the green outline shows the photo that's selected I'm gonna put it right after that oops I got it before it <clears throat> there we go now, on this particular photo, I have the opportunity to manage it by putting a pink screen over it, and that means that I don't want it displayed right now, but I'm leaving it in the animated widget file so that later on, perhaps, if I want to show that photo, all I have to do is click on the green arrow, it removes the red screen, and now you can see that it's visible again. If I wanted to delete the photo, I would click on the X there. And now it says, are you sure you want to permanently delete this photo? If I truly wanted to delete it, I would click OK. But for demonstration purposes, I'm going to say cancel. I don't want to delete it. I do, however, want to edit it. And therefore, I would click on that pencil image. And here it gives me an opportunity to put a caption in there. And I believe that I have a caption already here that I'm just going to copy and paste and now I'm coming back here to this window and I'm going to control V and drop it in there <clears throat> and I'm going to say OK and now I'm going to close that image or that manage window excuse me And now if I go to Hide Quick, which hides the quick edit, I'm experiencing this animated image as if I were simply visiting the website. So I can see the, the, the photos moving from one to the next. I have it set on a slow motion. Uh, I think it's about five seconds view time per photo because I'm hoping that gives the visitor enough time to read the captions, some of the captions are pretty extensive and there you have it it's actually quite easy to manage the animated image widgets and notice that I did that all I was logged in but I had not actually clicked on showing the quick edit for the body of the page so as soon as you see these options here that's where you can manage that widget if I were to click on this manage the body of the page there it shows me the animated image sitting there I cannot edit it from this place 
So I would have to cancel out of there if I had gone in there. And I have to add, edit it from this level here. I'm logged in, but I have not clicked on the edit the body of the page section. There you have it, how to manage the photos in an animated image widget.